How's it going all you game travelers out there? Sir Race here and welcome back to a game called Morale. I really don't know that much about this game. I saw that it was a recent release on Steam and I saw that there was a lot of positive uh, reactions to it. So I wanted to check out this game and see what this game is truly about and see what the hype is with this game. So we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. I wonder if it's a game to where I can like voice act and say different things and... Oh, what is this here? It looks like I can move my uh, character around a little bit. Oh, that's cool. Can we go inside the houses and whatnot? Uh, enter cabin. Yeah, let's enter the cabin. Well, hello there, little kid. Uh, talk to boy. I heard there is gold in the cave, but I'm too scared to enter. They said there's a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Oh, that's... That's scary. I don't know what I I don't like horror games, so this should be interesting. Hello, little boy. Need to stay close to mama's, otherwise she'll worry that we've won off. Okay. Hello, mother. Did you hear about the boy? Julia lost her son in the cave shortly after her husband died. Poor Julia. I would never let my boys out of for the sight. Uh, hello, Mr. Pastor Guy. Talk to priest. My prayers go out to poor Julia. It's been a year since her husband has passed. She hasn't been seen all day. I imagine she's grieving. Do you mind visiting her at her home? It's a house to the ray as you leave town. Yeah, of course I can do that. Uh, so I'm guessing that is leaving town there. Hello, little girl. Sometimes daddy lets us pat the sheep on the head. They're so soft. Such an innocent little girl. Okay. Uh, nothing in here looks like. Nothing of important. Look at the bookshelf. It's a picture of a shelf of the wife, husband, and young boy. I wonder where they are. Oh, please don't tell me that something happened to them. That would just be awful. I don't want anything to happen to them. Okay, looks like that's the town. I haven't been inside of this house, I think. Oh, hello, little girl. Talk to the girl. My uncle and dad are out chopping wood to keep us warm in the winter. They should keep us home soon. Uh, anything over here? Nothing over here. Nothing over here. Let's go ahead and leave the cabin. And let's go ahead and see. What, did I go in this, into this house? Yeah, I did. Let's go ahead and exit this house. Go into this one over here. Enter this cabin. Well, hello, big person. That looks kind of scary. It looks like I'm... It looks like a lovely day outside. You should get, you should head out to the farm if you get the chance. Spend some time with the animals. Well, I think I will, Chef. Thank you so much, Chef. Okay, let's go ahead and head this way. What is this sign? Read the signpost to the farm. Let's head out to the farm then. Well, hello there, farm. Nice to see this nice little farm. Can I pat the sheep on the head? Poke sheep. Bah! Nice. Okay. Uh, let's. Enter the barn. Okay, that's locked. We can't go in there, sadly. Let's go ahead and see what else there is around in this area. To see if there's anything fun over here. Well, hello there. Uh, to the cave. Oh, to the cave. That's kind of scary. Uh, pick up lantern. You pick up the lantern on the stump. Anything else over here? Talk to the lumberjack. My brother and I were chopping wood when we heard moans coming from the cave. My brother went in there to investigate. He should have been back by now. I'm worried. Can you check on him? There's a lantern behind you on the stump. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I don't like where this is going. I don't like where this is going already. I'm kind of scared, but... Oh, it's a creepy cave. Hey you! Come on right over here! I'm moving towards him. Did my brother send you? Bless him. The moans are coming from further down. I'll go, but my sight's no good. You should take this knife. Who knows? You might need it. I don't want the knife. I don't want this knife. It seems like you're trying to set me up for something here. Uh... I don't like the sound of this already. Uh, it seems like I'm just going around in circles the entire time, not really going anywhere. Oh man, I'm kind of scared right now. Look at the bones. Some must have died here. The bones look like they were of a child's. What is going on? I can see something shiny just out of my reach. Can I go in there? Doesn't look like you can go in there. 
Why am I playing this game? Why am I playing this game? Why am I playing this game? I am so scared out of my mind. I should have known it was a horror game. For, uh, uh, talk to the brother. Let's not go that way. Let's go this way first and see what's over here on this side. So it looks like someone's been murdered in here then. That's... Why am I still in these caves then if someone's been murdered? That's like a recipe for disaster right there. Uh, if I was smart, I would leave. What is this here? Seriously though, look at the tools. There are some tools leaning against the wall. It looks like they have been used to mark carvings on the wall. Oh man. What is this over here? Look at book. It's a book on the top of the pedestal. It's labeled Farmers. It's a list of names inside. Amy Reed, Ben, Billy, Jack. How airy. <laughs> Please no. Please no. I'm looking behind me on my on OBS to make sure that there's no one behind me because I'm freaking out right now. I do not like horror games. I need to play something that's fun and happy next. I guess we can go down to one place I haven't been. Uh, what's over here? What's over here? Uh, a farmer approaches. Why do you have blood on your overalls? Why do you have a knife? I heard moans. What have you done? Let him pass attack. Oh man. What should I do to this guy? What I heard moans. What have you done? Sip. Why do you have bloods on your overall? Suck. Why do you have a knife? Well, I gotta attack you now. Look at the body. There's a name on it on the farmer's overalls. Suck, Papa. Okay. Well, that's nothing exciting. Let's move on. That that's weird. That he really couldn't say anything. It's like he was unable to. Did I just murder some- I think I just murdered someone. I think I just murdered someone. Why do I hear so much talking? Seriously though. Oh no. Erg, please help me. I'm in a lot of pain. I came here to end my life. His name is Julia, and I want to see my children and husband in heaven. My husband was a miner in the caves. He spent days mining for gold, and then one day he found something. He found a golden nugget. I thought we could retire and live comfortable for the rest of my lives, but he didn't trust me. He buried the golden nugget and to spite me, then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about our good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. One day, my son wandered into the cave. He wanted to find his daddy. He wanted to make everything better. But he never came out of the cave. I went to look for him. But now I couldn't find him. Now it's too late. Now I have nobody. Would you help me? Would you help me in my life? You've done it before. It shouldn't be easier the second time. Help me end my life. You've done it before. It should be easier this I have- I've never done it, though. Oh, man. No! I'm gonna go get help. Don't leave me, you coward. Okay, I will. Oh, for a second, I thought the thing was following me. I got kind of scared there. Well, let's- let's head out and see if we can get this person some help. Uh, which way was it supposed to go? Which way am I supposed to go? Oh. Hello there, farmer. Uh. Uh. Where am I supposed- A farmer approaches. What? Why do you have blood on your overalls? Uh, what am I supposed to say? Well. Uh, do-, do am I supposed to lie here? No, I, I shouldn't lie. I should. I should say. I should tell the truth. Well, someone was attacking. I didn't know what to do. 
No. What what should I say? Someone was attacking. And I saw someone who had blood on her. There was nothing I could do. That's why I have blood. That's why. Why do you have a knife? Well, the farmer gave it to me. What, what are they supposed to do? I hear moans. What have you done? I didn't do anything. It was her. I didn't do anything. Let me see what will happen to you. At least that's where the story shall end, at least for now. It's up to the next player of this game to choose your fate. As you chose for the previous player? Did I just kill a previous... Did I just kill a previous player of this game and ended his life just like that because I didn't believe what he was saying? Is, is that for real? What? Okay, Ray. Okay, and my email address. Let me uh, put that in real quick. You have been emailed about your faith. Thanks for playing. Oh my goodness. So that does not mean that my actions are going to be represented and my responses in those questions are going to be represented in the next playthrough of this game and they will have the choice to either kill me or to save me. Oh my goodness. This game is amazing. Now I understand why there is so much hype. And that's it. That was literally it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So if there is an actual response, I'll go ahead and comment down uh, in the uh, comment section or I'll put it in the description of exactly what happened. So if you're interested to see what happens, go ahead and look at my description or my comment section. It should be somewhere in there. Spoilers, of course, if you don't want to know. But oh my goodness, that means some random person is going to decide my fate of either I'm going to die or not. And I, I killed that person. I didn't, I didn't know what else to do. There was a let him go. I, I should have done that. Oh my goodness. That was... That was interesting. That was very, very interesting. I can understand why there was a lot of hype on this game now. But okay. I'll go ahead and end the episode here then. Oh my goodness. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to smack that like button for me. Thank you guys so, so, so much for the support. Do the dang thing, and I will see you guys in the next episode. Adios. Dude, stop. Well, I didn't want you to get to the rule book to tell me not to do things, so of course I had to do that. Oh, I can become the best like no one ever was. Dun, dun, dun.